Whispers in my hair What you gonna do? So take it, kid, away When chicken in your head Chip turn it off Welcome back to another vlog. So it's Monday and it's, I don't know what day it is, but it's Monday, but I don't know the date, so I'm gonna put it here. And um, it's the work day, back to work, back on the grind. Y'all already know how it is. Um, I just, you know, I've been up from like five o'clock, so to get them kids ready for school and out the door with their dad. But you guys saw earlier after I got them ready, I went and did some um, Etsy orders, came in over the weekend and um, doing some things on my YouTube channel and on the back end. So then I opened up the house as you guys saw and then have my little vacuum, like my vacuum is cool. Like I have that vacuum and I just put it to go. My battery dying, oh crap. Yeah, my vacuum is cool like when I'm trying to go to school because if they see the vacuum turn on, they'll be chasing the vacuum like they never see the vacuum before or like yeah and then i was outside taking some pictures because i have a um consultation today with one of the sharon williams um paint professionals to help us pick a color for the house i think i got i get a color i want already but i still gonna do the um consultation and see get some advice from them as well so i here do my hair my camera battery is dying so let me hurry up and do my hair i just gonna curl it i was thinking i'll leave it in a flat enough but i think i'm gonna curl it I just gonna curl it and then head back out to check my email and stuff. Right now it's um, quiet, so I'm gonna finish getting ready and then you know go make my tea and then um, head back and check some emails and start my work for the day. I love my bangs. I don't know, I might keep them. Who knows? It depends on how I feel then. But the next thing, I put my hair. All right, we ready for the day. When you look good, you get up and you do good, okay? So make sure you guys out there looking good, even though you're working at home, make sure you get up, put on something, get yourself together so you can be motivated. Cause when you look good, you feel good, you do good, you wanna be you know, doing all kind of things so you look good. Mm. Oh, and this set I got from, um, I have ideas that when I had my son, like to exercise and stuff, and I ain't know where it's again after that. I was like, I know what I'm exercising. I was like, my mm. these from Amazon. This set, I got like three of them. I'll list them in my Amazon store, link below in the description. Let's get to work. All right, y'all, so my fragrance of today, excuse me, pardon me, Hello, gorgeous. Y'all, if I know how much this perfume for, y'all go check it out. But 
this perfume is delina like i didn't even know it had a perfume named delina until i have until like after i had my daughter so if i know how much it's safe go check it out go check it out so one life to live guys this is what i'm putting on today to be home okay don't let your expensive stuff just sit here and wait until you're ready to go wear it tomorrow is not promised now let's spray on some of this where are your stuff we need two puffs though <laughs> Okay, you guys, so I got my tea. Mm. Good. And I got a bagel this morning with peanut butter. Something simple. Um, so, goals for today go through whatever um, open requests that I have in my queue and close out the ones where follow up with those that um, I sent emails to and haven't responded. I'm gonna follow up to them and then those that i need to close out i'm gonna close out that i've completed and then start on the new ones um sorting them by which one needs to go first so that's my goals for today i have a meeting right now in the next 30 minutes i have a meeting starting at 11 so I'm gonna prepare for that and um yeah so let's follow up with these folks that we haven't heard back from Yeah. Okay. Have you looked at any Sherwin yeah. Williams colors yet? Yes. SW6345. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Sumptuous. Okay. Okay, sumptuous. Right. <laughs> and then I actually went in the store and I picked up the little cards. So I looked mm -hmm. to the back of the cards to get one of the um, matching, the colors that will go well with it on the back of the cards. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. yeah. That definitely looks like sumptuous peach. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Agreed. So that would definitely a little more peachy. Yeah. All right. Okay, just a quick update on my work. So I already sent out the emails, touch base with those that need to follow up with. Yeah, so I sent out uh, um, a data poll that I did like Friday. I was waiting on them to reply. I don't know, I do like Thursday. But I sent them an email to confirm exactly what I want, but it didn't. So I just sent them like the basic stuff because I wanted to close out the request. So I just sent out this morning. And then now I'm working on another request where I'm pulling a certain group of folks enrolled in uh, like a specific course um, from a specific time period. That's what I'm doing right now. So I'm coding in base apps and I'm just running that code right now. It shouldn't be, you know what? Let me add this. Remember the Tableau project I was working on last week? I are, I updated it, but let me add it to our um, SharePoint and what I'm talking about. Hey guys, so it's after 12 now and I've just been here working. Um, so that Tableau project I was working on last week, I was telling you guys earlier, before my mom called. 
um i updated it but i'm gonna put it on our share drive because we have a share drive so i'm just gonna drop it in there so if anybody wants to you know take a look at it with the updated data they could see it they could download it from up there instead of having to come back to me um for me to send it to them so that's why i'm that's what i just finished up doing and then um am i missing an info box i am missing an info box Oh, okay i just one of my requests is just email me back so i could close out that request yay okay uh, i love it yeah so i'm gonna close out that request because she emailed me back and told me it was completed so, so let me continue pulling this list of students enrolled what was it in a specific course okay you guys so it's like after one and i just got my um hello fresh package they have to drop it on this side like then i'll unbox it a little later because i'm still doing some work and i want to get it out the way before i start to do something new Got, um, a little chicken and rice so this is just my leftovers from yesterday chicken and black beans and rice Did y'all have fun today? Who behaved? Yeah. Did you behave? Hold on. Hey -oh. Peanut butter jelly. That's an old song. You don't even know about that. Peanut butter jelly. You behaved today? I heard you behaved today. Let's go. In, in the back. It's a little later in the day. We're here going to the um, Sharon Williams paint store to get some samples of the um, paint I was recommending earlier in the um, consultation that I had. So I need to make sure to see what time they close. Check to see what time they close, no? So we have to be turning around. <laughs> Change your plan, guys. 
<sighs> We're going in Lowe's instead because Sharon Williams will be closed by the time we reach there. They closed six and it was like 5.40 right now. Yeah, it's so hot. Y'all hot? So, yeah. Yeah. I think we're talking about something like this. No. But this is the one I like to see. Oh, but no. Oh, mini mouse. So cute. Yeah, give me your mouse. We could probably get these for them. Yeah. Look at the ones that are be like by the ocean. chicken wraps tonight because it's five minutes 20 minutes to cook so, this is easy I didn't feel like doing a heap of extra stuff today yeah. no I think it came in So it's Tuesday. I have a meeting at 8:30. Right now it's 8:12. We have a um, team meeting. So I just got them kids their breakfast. As you guys saw, who was playing with bubbles and stuff earlier. What are we gonna, oh, I was playing with them a little bit with some bubbles and stuff. While the breakfast was making. So now they're eating, and then I'm gonna get their stuff ready to bathe them and get them ready for the day. So I just here checking emails. And, um, so my meeting is 8 30. It's all um division meeting, so I'd have tried to attend when I could. It's just like all the different departments under our VP they give updates on what they're working on. I think our department this week is giving updates. So I'm definitely gonna be in this one while I'll uh, getting them ready um for the day. So I just had checking emails. I have to close out this request. Still working on another request I was working on yesterday. I just have to finalize some stuff with it. So, goals for the day. I'm gonna put my goals for the day on the screen. And um, let's see how much we can achieve. Let's get this day started. Perfect. Oh, wait, God. Uh, you might want to mute. Mute, mute, mute. You hear it? Because the air is very strong. Can you hear it?
Oh my god, this is gonna take long. Alright, you guys, so I just got the kids down for the nap. Um, it's after 12, it's like 12, 12, it's 12 11 right now, so they're working on my project. Right now, I'm adding their um, ID data, like their names, their um, last name, first name. I've already pulled the list that I needed, I pulled a list of um folks that I need with a certain criteria that that's taking the um, course that I need to pull for so now I'm adding in there so it don't give you like the name and stuff it just give you like the identification number and then all the rest of the data so I'm gonna take that identification number and then join it with another table where this um, ID like the name the ID and everything join those two tables together and pull out the data that I need so that's what I'm doing now All right, you guys, so it's like a couple hours later, it's like after three. Kids are up, a little bit of coloring, but I just got an ad hoc request. We need to get this fixed because I had created a store process and like the end user isn't able to get it run. I don't know why, we need to fix that for her. So I can work on this ad hoc request for my boss, Delina. Okay, so I run enough for her and then let me, I tried to find the request that he um, asked me to update because I did do it, but I'm not seeing the original file. I don't think I have the original code for that. I had add a um, flag. I remember adding a flag to it, but I don't think I have the original code. So I need to see if I created the original data set. I probably didn't. I don't think I did. Uh, I'm not seeing this one. Yes? Give me one second, okay? You want a snack? Okay, go sit down on the table and I'm gonna bring it. Who wants that? Who wants you? Okay. No, this one said prosper with credit spine. Wait. Oh Lord. Good morning. So it's Thursday, y'all. I'm getting tired. You didn't even take out my hair today. So um it's like eleven o'clock. I start late today. So those kids are home today. I got up, got them ready, got them fed. Got myself ready a while ago. And um, so I'm just making breakfast now. And I've been running some food earlier, working on the project I was working on yesterday with the um, flagging the um, students, new and old, who received the grant. I mean, just seeing her was like the moment she was hired. She had challenges. Okay, you guys, I just wanna explain a little bit what I'm doing, so how I'm pulling my data. So I'm using SAS, I'm coding in SAS. I'm not using um, any pro any SQL code right now like a proxy equal so um i imported my two tables one is the new table with all the new people and the old people and then the other one is the old table that i had that i did previously before so that i have all the old people on there no new people so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna like i imported them and now i'm gonna do um a merge based off of their unique id so both of them have the same unique id on each table a column for that excuse me sir yeah, so this is how I'm gonna write it in SAS and then move back. So this is how I'll write it in SAS. Your head is in the way. I'm trying to talk to them. Watch out, go watch the tablet. Okay, so I'm gonna have data, name my table, and then I'm gonna do merge. You guys saw the word merge. So the new table is called new, the name of the scholarship students. And the old table is called old, the name of the scholarship students. So I'm gonna put the new table first. And then I'm gonna put the old table underneath and then I'm gonna set, tell it to join it by the unique ID and then under that I'm gonna write a statement if you're in the new table and you're in the old table then you're gonna create a variable that's gonna say the name of the scholarship old will equal yes so I'm trying to identify those on the new table that are on the old table so those are those who are in the new and old are considered old people who already got the scholarship. So I'm flagging those people. So if you're in the new table and the old table, then old will equal yes. 
if you're not then all would equal no so that's exactly what i'm doing and then i'm just gonna pull back everybody I'm just gonna pull everybody from the um all the rules from the new table let me finish this up export it and then send it out and then that's that's what i request and then i'll take the next one